It's not just cars and trucks on the roadways, but with the harvest season approaching, you'll be sharing the streets with ag equipment as well. News 5's Will Sherritt talks with local safety officials on what you should be aware of. Safety is one of those things that must not be overlooked in the course of getting those crops out of the field. It's one of the busiest times of the year for farmers, harvest season. But with it come dangers as well. We've had numerous, you know, at least half a dozen incidents already this year. Leanne Dose of the Southern Power District urges farm workers to be aware of overhead power lines and to keep extensions at least 10 feet away. Always look up for power lines. That's, that's, the, that's one thing that people should remember. Simple message, two words, look up. And as machines continue to grow, the risks become greater as equipment can become entangled in the power lines. Dose says it's critical to remain inside your farm equipment until help arrives. To avoid serious injury or even death. We tend to see contact incidents with combines, with grain carts, especially anything that has an auger is a real risk out there during harvest. During this time of year, the roads might look a little different too, with an increased amount of agricultural equipment on the roadways. We have a lot of prevalent slow moving vehicles, whether they be uh, implements traveling from one field to another or loaded uh, grain trucks that are having a tough time getting up to highway speed. And Captain Chris Kolb of the Nebraska State Patrol says you should adjust your speed to account for the equipment. Give those folks time to get accelerated up to highway speed as they pull out on the roadways. So whether it's on the road or in the field, the message is simple. We, we want people to take the extra time uh, to take safety measures so that they're here for, for the harvest of 2015. In Grand Island, I'm Will Sherritt.